taking responsibility for whatever happens to you, knowing that you have consciously made the decisions that are now affecting you, knowing that what is happening now, the direct result of your activity, what you did yesterday. Self-reliance is basically counting on yourself, trusting yourself, being confident with yourself, being responsible to yourself, trusting the conclusions that you have developed from your study of experiences and philosophies, learning from the mistakes that you have made, being self-reliant. They say that by deciding not to carry an umbrella every day, you have made the decision to endure an occasional drenching. Translation, by not being prepared, you make the choice of getting caught in some of life's unpleasant circumstances. Failures, economic losses, professional losses, personal losses. By not being prepared, it's your choice. By being prepared, you increase your chances of success of seizing opportunities when they come your way, of being ready within yourself to take advantage of once-in-a-lifetime situations. Some people tend to blame others for their mistakes. Now, you can't control what others around you do, but it's in your own best self-interest that you stay on top of things, especially if it's going to affect your future. Be responsible for the things that affect you. You can make sure you're more responsible by checking in with those people who are working with you. You can be more responsible by saying, Hey John, how are you doing with your part? Do you need some help? Now if John consistently doesn't handle his part, you've got to replace John. Or what? It will negatively affect you. You can't wake up in the morning hoping and wishing that John has done his part. You've got to be responsible because it's going to affect your career too. And I used to say something like, I sure hope things will change for the better. Then here's what I found out. They're not going to change. When you change, when you get better, it'll get better. Don't put it on someone else. Hope that someone else will change it for you. Take responsibility for yourself. You can't change the circumstances or the seasons or the wind, but you can change your reading habits. Burn the midnight oil, turn yourself around. That you've got charge of. That you have control of. And if you don't, that's your fault. You've got to take personal responsibility. You've got to be self-reliant. You, nobody else can change your life. Pave a golden road for you. But you can. It's up to you. Be responsible for yourself. Learn to reap the harvest without complaint. And here's where it comes from. Taking full responsibility. For everything you do, be responsible to yourself. Whatever your paycheck is, take full responsibility. You say, well, it's my employer. No, it's not your employer. You can become twice as valuable, three times as valuable doing everything in your power to stay on track. Whenever your preparations lead to success, you reinforce the disciplines that got you there. If what you're doing is working, keep doing it. If what you're doing isn't working, change it. When you are doing all that you can possibly do and are successful at reaching your expectations, keep doing it. Psychologists call this positive reinforcement. 